Text 32 O son of Pritha, those who take shelter in me, though they may be of lower birth, women, Vaishyas and Shudras, can attain the supreme destination. It is clearly declared here by the Supreme Lord that in devotional service there is no distinction between the higher and lower classes of people. In the material conception of life there are such divisions but for a person engaged in transcendental devotional service to the Lord there are not. Everyone is eligible for the supreme destination. In the Srimad Bhagavatam it is stated that even the lowest who are called dog eaters can be purified by association of a pure devotee. Therefore devotional service and the guidance of a pure devotee are so strong that there is no discrimination between the lower and higher classes of men anyone can take to it. The most simple man taking shelter of the pure devotee can be purified by proper guidance. According to the different modes of material nature, men are classified in the mode of goodness, the mode of passion, the mixed modes of passion and ignorance, and the mode of ignorance. Those lower than them are called Kandalas and they are born in sinful, sinful families. Generally, the association of those born in sinful families is not accepted by the higher classes. But the process of devotional service is so strong that the pure devotee of the Supreme Lord can enable people of all the lower classes to attain the highest perfection of life. This is possible only when one takes shelter of Krishna. As indicated here by the word, Vyapastriya, one has to take completely shelter of Krishna. Then one can become much greater than great Jananis and Yogis.